Hello everyone, I'm going to be reviewing Cinderella. Um, you're wondering, what Cinderella film? Uh, it's a new one, uh, from 2021. Yeah, they went to Amazon Prime. Prime Video, whatever. Anyway, uh, Cinderella is directed by Kay Cannon, written by Kay Cannon, based on Cinderella by Charles Patrol, uh, produced by Jamie Corden, Leo Perlman, uh, Jonathan Caden, and Shannon McIntosh, starring Camille Cabello, and Dan Menzel, uh, Minnie Driver, Nicholas Gazan, uh, Billy Porter, and Pierce Brosnan. Uh, cinematography from Henry Braham, edited by Stacey Schroeder, uh, music by Michelle Denner and Jessica West. Uh, production companies from Sonic Pictures and Fuel 73. <coughs> Excuse me. Distributed by Amazon Studios, released September 3rd, 2021. Ran for 113 minutes. And yeah, so the plot Cinderella is an ambiguous young woman who wants to establish her shop, dressed by Ella. One day, in a partial sorority of society, she catches, uh, she catches the eye of Prince Robert in the guard. In the guard changing ceremony, the next day the prince, dressed as a, com a commoner, goes to market. Uh, goes to the market where he finds Ella, trying to sell her dress and buys it from her. He later invites her to the ball, being held two weeks later with the uh, promise of introducing her to a variety of people from the world to sell her dress dresses to. Yeah, cast: Camila Cabello as Cinderella, India Menzel as Vivian. Uh, Mini Driver is Queen Beatrice, Nicholas Gatown, uh, Ghazali or whatever is Crown Prince Robert, um, Billy Porter is Fabulous Godmother, Pierce Brosnan is Kings uh, Rowan, Maddie uh, Bilalo is Mavola, Charlotte Spencer is Narissa, Rob Beckett is Thomas Cecil, uh, Talaluya Grieve is Princess Queen, and Doc Brown is Town Career. Career? I don't even know what the hell that is. But okay. Production. In April 2019, Columbia Pictures announced a music retelling of Cinderella with Kate Cannon writing and directing. The idea to represent, uh, reinterpret, sorry, Cinderella came from James Gordon, who produced the film throughout, uh, Flew Well 73 with Leo Perlman, Jonathan Cady, and Jenna McIntosh. In April 2019, Camilla Cabello was attached in the role as Cinderella. In October 2019, it was announced and talks, uh, it was talks with underway with India Menzel as Cinderella's stepmother and Billy Porter for the role of the fairy godparent. In, uh, in December 2019, Nicholas Gatana, a cousin, sorry, was, was added as class of, a cast of Prince Robert. Principal photography began in February 2020 at Pinewood Studios in the United Kingdom. Filming was suspended in, to, uh, in March 2020 due to the COVID-19 pandemic. Uh, production resumed in August 2020 and uh, concluded in September. Cinderella carriage was designed to promote Mercedes Benz. Yeah. Now let's talk about my thoughts of Cinderella. Um, where do I start? They, I can see that they were trying to make a good Cinderella film. For me, it didn't really work. I think Camila Cabello as Cinderella, she does have good acting skills, but I don't think she would be that great as Cinderella. I think she could have been, like, another actress, like, another actress could have portrayed Cinderella, but I do think that Camila Cabello does have acting chops, like Lady Gaga from A Star Is Born. She's known for her music. I was skeptical walking into watching A Star Is Born because we didn't know how she could have done, but she did great, and I think, I mean, I didn't really want Camila Cabello as Cinderella, but she was alright, but she does have good acting chops, and yeah, I, the story for this film was decent, the casting was decent, um, yeah, the story, yeah, the acting was good enough, but for my entertainment, I just didn't really enjoy it that much. Um, but Cinderella, I saw it was trying its hardest to be a good movie for me. Didn't land perfectly, but I do... There is some enjoyment out of it. And the, and the songs are decent. 
I have to say. But yeah, for my score for Cinderella, I'm going to be giving it a 2 out of 5 stars. For Cinderella, I'm going to be giving it a 44%. Great, I'm going to be giving it a D-, and out of 10, I'm going to be giving it a 4.4 out of 10. Thank you for watching my review for Cinderella. Hope you enjoyed it. Please subscribe to my channel. Be a big help. Thanks for watching. Take care. Peace.